I'd like to um, show you a new feature that just went out in today's D9 release, um, and that is tracing. Tracing is designed to allow you to get features that you can't otherwise do today or previously, such as these uh, interior radius fillets, uh, like this chamfered um, cut like this. Um, so let's just do this really quickly. Uh, let's say I have a taper tool. Um, it goes to a fine point, and I go into tracing, and I say plus and it'll analyze the part, show me the features that it recognizes, and then when I hover over them, it's gonna allow me to select them. So I'm gonna check, uh, select the, uh, the base of this channel here for the chamfer tool, and you can see in the lower left of the screen, it'll show you the tool that was selected for that part. Now, um, let's do one of these other ones. Let's say we have um, an eighth ball mill that's gonna match this um, Fill it right here. We're going to select the inside because we want the middle of the tool to follow that path. This isn't fully implemented yet. The type is currently followed. There'll be an inset and an outset um, for other use cases in the future. Let's take a quarter inch ball mill that's going to match this one here. Um, obviously, you wouldn't do this in the real world, but I'm just going to show you. You can now uh, preview this. It's going to show you the paths that it's going to take. And because we have stock set, I can animate it so we can see the tool here. And let's just run it through the paces. And you see it changing the tools, cutting out these parts, um, and matching the, uh, the surfaces. So uh, typically what you would do is you would rough this out first and then run this as a final pass. Um, I don't want to make this video unnecessarily long. I just want to show you how to use this uh, tool. Um, you can go back in after you've done this and you can deselect things and change them. Um, and again, see what you used by hovering over them. So um, super useful new feature, going to be great for engraving and other types of things. Um, I hope you enjoy, hope it's useful for you. Um, please report bugs. This is probably the most raw code I've put out yet, so it's pretty sure to have a lot of bugs. Um, and it's going to get a lot better before the 2.4 the final release, but I wanted to get out there for people to play with. So enjoy, feedback, hope to hear from you. Thanks for your time.